hello everyone uh, welcome to the new session of phoenix device driver so in previous video we saw that how we can load uh, build a linux kernel module so today we will see uh, how we can load and unload kernel module from the kernel so there are certain utilities which uh, used to load and un unload kernel module uh, for loading the kernel module uh, we use two utility called ins mode and mode probe so ins mode is a basic utility that can load module into the kernel and it resolve dependency from kernel ta uh, symbol table uh, we will see uh, in later videos uh, what is a kernel symbol table uh, currently just uh, remember that uh, that uh, ins mode only resolve dependency from kernel symbol table the second utility is mode probe uh, which is a advanced utility that can load module into kernel and also resolve dep dependency from uh, kernel symbol table if it is not found in a kernel symbol table mode probe is try to search in different module and uh, if it get from that uh, different module uh, it try to load that uh, module into the kernel and resolve that dependency uh, as you can see the uh, syntax of ins mode is uh, sudo ins mode module name and you can uh, also specify uh, parameters we will see uh, module parameters in later videos and uh, syntax for mode probe is sudo mode probe uh, module name and module parameters for unloading module we can use uh, rm mode so the syntax of rm mode is sudo rm mode model name uh, here we do, uh, does not require to specify dot uh, ko and also we can use mode probe for the unloading module uh, we have to specify hyphen r option and the syntax for uh, mode probe to unload the module from kernel is uh, sudo mode probe hyphen r uh, model name and it is possible to unload module forcefully when uh, uh, module is under use so for that we have to specify hyphen f uh, with uh, rm mode and hyphen rf with mode probe we can load uh, uh, we can sorry we can list uh, kernel module using uh, ls mode and uh, uh, the command d message used to see kernel log and also uh, i want to explain what is the difference between application and uh, linux kernel module so uh, the main difference between application and linux kernel module is uh, module are event driven which means uh, when uh, we load a kernel module into the kernel uh, it inform uh, to user application that uh, uh, hello i am here and when we unload that uh, kernel module it inform uh, user application that uh, currently i am uh, not available for the uses so uh, we can say that module are event driven and the second main difference is uh, application are lazy to uh, uh, release the allocated resource because uh, in application we do not have a facility like uh, exit function so when we close the application uh, we manually have to release that uh, allocated resource and if we forgot that uh, uh, implementing that uh, function then uh, that resource is not uh, released but uh, in case of module uh, when we unload the module uh, the exit function automatically called so we can re uh, release all the resources in into that uh, function so let me just uh, give a uh, example of loading and unloading of uh, kernel module so here uh, i have uh, one folder which have uh, one kernel module as you can see main.ko so let me just load that uh, module using ins mode so sudo sudo ins mode main.ko uh, to see that uh, we can use d message as you can see i previously load and unload that module but last this message is here hello world and uh, let me just remove from uh, that module from the kernel sudo 
remote main and just type the message as you can see uh, message is called by by world so by this you can load and unload module from the kernel uh, please try mode probe using yourself and share your result with me uh, in comment section so this is all about today's session mm, and uh, in further session we will see uh, deep in uh, character device driver we will implement uh, initialization function and uh, exit function so stay tuned for the new videos